doing it, and we're doing it at a much faster pace than anyone thought. I will say that never has there been a president, with few exceptions, in the case of FDR, he had a major depression to handle, who's passed more legislation, who's done more things than what we've done. Between the executive orders and the job-killing regulations that have been terminated, uh, many bills, I guess over 34 bills in Congress signed, a Supreme Court justice who's going to be a great one, going to be a great Supreme Court justice, and many other things we've achieved tremendous success. And I think we've been about as active as you can possibly be and at a just about record-setting pace. And we're achieving these goals by eliminating these job-killing regulations, unlocking American energy, rebuilding our military, pursuing fair and reciprocal trade deals, achieving massive reductions in illegal immigration, transforming the Department of Veterans Affairs, and building a new partnership among nations to defeat terrorism, which we have to do. In just a very short time, we're seeing amazing results. And in fact, there are a couple of major stories today in the newspapers about mines that are opening and the miners are going back to work. Actually, the pretty big stories. People are surprised. It's kicking in very fast. More small businesses are planning to hire than at any point in over a decade. And last month, unemployment fell to its lowest point in 16 years. I recently returned from a trip overseas that included deals for more than $350 billion worth of military and economic investment in the United States. These deals will bring many thousands of jobs to our country, and in fact, will bring millions of jobs ultimately, and help Saudi Arabia take a greater role in providing stability and security in that region. Uh, one of the big things that we did, and you're seeing it now with Qatar and all of the things that are actually going on in a very positive fashion, uh, we are stopping the funding of terrorism. They are going to stop the funding of terrorism. And it's not an easy fight, but that's a fight we're going to win. There will be, you have to starve the beast, and we're going to starve the beast, believe me. Secretary Price has been working very hard to repeal and replace Obamacare. The ha House passed a bill. The Senate has it right now. Uh, Mitch McConnell is working very, very hard, as are the Republican senators. We will have zero backing from the Democrats, even though uh, they should get in and do something. But we expect to get zero. If we had the greatest bill in the history of the world on health care, we wouldn't get one vote from the Democrats because they're obstructionists. That's 